Hey, what's up YouTube? Uh, coming up with another uh, bad video. Anyway, I wanted to show you here. I just received this from Sportsman's Guide yesterday. This is an Italian military surplus leather stool. Um, it's actually made pretty well. I mean, if you take a look, this thing has real leather. This is like saddle, saddle thickness. I mean, look how thick that is. I didn't measure it, but I mean, look how thick that thing is. Um, it's made with uh, real wood. Um, another cool thing is you've got the strap on here. So what the strap really is for is so that I can uh, carry this across my uh, shoulders. Um, now normally I don't, I don't buy stuff like this. Uh, this is not something you really want to hike with unless you're going a short distance. Um, I kind of got it because I don't know, uh, I just buy stuff on impulse, but uh, <clears throat> I can actually use this. So my son does stuff like Taekwondo, soccer, swimming, um, Boy Scouts, uh, he has a lot of activities outside of school. So, um, this is nice. I can just throw it in my vehicle and then I can carry this and I've got some place to sit because a lot of these places, they don't have any place to sit or they're really busy or, or too full like at Taekwondo. Um, so I can just take this thing, drop it off and I've got something to sit on. Um... I just like the way this thing is made. So, you know, online you can't tell as well until you actually get it. Um, I will attempt to show you right now. But this is about 24 inches tall. And it's about 16 inches, well, yeah, about 16 inches wide when you open it up. Um, you can see here this thing actually folds up they do have a strap on here so that this thing doesn't open so let's take a look this is made by Patton so this is made in Germ uh, excuse me <laughs> Germany Italy this is made in Italy and uh, I don't know exactly when this was made I'm, I'm assuming in the 2002 2010 or even later but it did have a um, you know like a, a tag on there which I, I took off um, sorry about that and I left it at work um, anyway um, it's got this nice strap on the, the bottom here to keep that from opening too far as well as the leather on the top you got this small leather, leather um, strap so you, once you fold it, you can keep it together. And once again, I'm not going to show you because I can't. I can't show it. I can't put this phone down and then show me carrying this. But I would put this over my neck, and then I can control it, and then also put my hand on it as well to support it if I'm transporting it somewhere. Um, I don't know. I mean, this is really, you know, something I, I can use. I don't need it. This is one of those kind of vanity things. But, uh, wanted to show you. This is on Sportsman's Guide. It only costs $35.99. And it can hold me, you know, currently I'm around 215 pounds. You see here, this thing's not, it's not falling apart. Um, it's got sturdy, real leather. Um, so some of the stuff I used on this, so I didn't really need to clean it much because it, it was pretty much brand new. Um, but I did use the Lexol. And so that kind of cleans it up and kind of, conditions it a little bit 
Um, and I use that only on the leather. And then on the entire rest of it, including the wood, I used uh, some Open Offs LP. This is worn out. I'm almost empty too. I need to order some more. Anyway, Odinoff's uh, LP works really well because it has uh, beeswax in there plus whatever their um, pri uh, pro Ugh. see I can't talk now. Anyway, their uh, oils inside of there, so this will kind of hydrate it a little bit, and then with the beeswax helps pr protect it from uh, you know water and things like that. Um, Anyway, if you have any questions, comments, or whatever, just put it on the uh, comments section. I'll try to answer as soon as I can. Just wanted to show you some cool stuff, in my opinion. Anyway, have a good day. Goodbye.